All right, we're still on our SSD where we promise to video everything to make sure we film everything. And um, we've done already our stuff in the sense that with a PKS YUA, you check out that everything is up to date and it is. Now, what I've all totally forgotten in the other video is of course to do our scale and a lot of things more to do to be up to date again. So first off, scale is a good thing. So if you don't know what it is, look it up on articlinux.com. So it's an alias and the alias is gonna copy paste everything over. And another thing you probably notice if you're on Article Linux, this alias is very short. So we need to fix our bash RC as well because there are more mirrors. There are four mirrors and there are only two. And I mentioned that in the other video, but I totally forgot to do it actually. So scale is the first thing. We get the new stuff in. So that's one thing. Uh, remember, there's also this, this backup scale thing that's interesting to, for you to check out. Uh, it gives you more knowledge and understanding of what's happening on your machine. And luckily in June, I did a um, backup scale, which means I can now easily do a compare. So with my new button that we just had here, melt menu, compare, we can actually change or not change, uh, take a look uh, what changed on our system. You see, there is a new Conky available, some medallions available, um, all kinds of information. So all that's green and blue has changed. You can actually go in there and see, oh yeah, it moves from top right to middle right, some more caps, uh, etc., etc. So it's all in here. The information is there. Just make sure this is off because otherwise you'll see the identical stuff. You don't want to see the identical stuff. You want to see the show new and show modified. Okay, but the stay rolling thing is also an, an important thing uh, to take a look. So the scale is done. Okay, now there's one thing maybe before I forget it again. Um, there is also the Bash RC and the Bash RC latest. These two guys are important. When you melt these two guys, you'll see what I see. Uh, you see that I'm missing a lot of stuff here. We have the typos that are not working on Plasma, update or update, right? Upate, again, typo, and a little script that is going to fix our um, course if needed. Um, you just have to do it once, of course. There's a new alias in there, up all, instead of PKSYUA. Got a little bit tired of that, so if we're gonna change it to up all and this one stays in, you can keep using that one. We'll start using from September 2019, up all. The CB is an important one, um, which is not working now, so we need to fix that as well. So let's do this. Now you can either do, what, what am I thinking? We can actually say control A, control C, which is probably the easiest thing to do and say, this is coming from Arch, uh, sorry, Arco Linux, right? Bash RC latest, control A. And this is what you're having. The Bash RC is what's working right now. So control A, delete, control V. That's the easiest way for me to just make sure that I have everything. So, okay, save. Then I need to, I'm looking for the easiest way, of course, right? Then I'm gonna go for right mouse click for actions, open terminal here. And then I'm gonna source, I'm gonna say, hey, go and have a look at the Bash RC load everything up because there are new stuff in there. Now the new stuff is in here and it's actually working already. I can up all everything. Okay, so that's working. But <clears throat> what's not working, um, what, what's gonna happen in the future, if I'm gonna press scale, now the Bash RC is gone again. The old Bash RC from the time we installed it that is still in ETC scale that's the one that's gonna kick in. So this guy is gonna be overwriting my one, my, my new one, my new version. So I don't want this guy to come and say, up all is gone again, you see? 
ours has another line here. It says alias up all and then the same thing. So there is a little script for that and it's just called copy bash. And copy bash is going to make sure that everything is also changed in here. That we do have an up hole. We have here the typos. And somewhere down here, we have somewhere up hole, right? So now we can do without any problem a scale. And the bash RC in our ETC scale is just exactly the same as the one in our bash RC in our home directory. So overwrite whatever you want because it's the same anyway. Okay, so that's a little trick you need to remember CB or copy bash alias that we have. So that's a set. I think we are ready. There's just one thing to check. Is there anything relevant in the stay rolling from last month? Maybe check these two and see what's in there. Is there anything relevant to our plasma system? Here is just text, no, nothing to do, nothing to do. And here is just a change version, Control Alt T. Um, we have version 1906.1. So we've moved already from five to six, fine. Okay, so nothing to do at this point in time. And then 1906, 1907, open it up. We've changed something in the blueberry settings. We have a blueberry setting. Oops, that's not the blueberry setting. Let's move you out of the way. This one. Add new device. We can actually open it up, stop it and open it up. So that's not an issue, as you see on Plasma. We can just stop it and open it up. So this is something specific for, for us. We don't need that run as well. The only thing is this line. So this line is something we like probably to have. So we have a new version number. Well, we could actually do a Control C, Control Alt T, Control Shift V, Enter password enter control t and you have version 1907.9 so that's as simple as that um, we're all up to date we've checked it and next month there'll be another no not next month but in september there will be another iso and another folder thing okay going from 1907 to 1909 and anything we've uh, changed on the isos will reflect in these scripts Okay, now we are really up to date and up to speed and we can keep on having fun. Cheers.